Oh, I felt we were on the line, so uh, be ready for a lot of uh, <laughs> negativity because Felv is on the line. <laughs> What's up, Wiggy? <laughs> What's up? What's up, Phil? So, listen, I think you're lucky to be in it because I think the refs have let you into it. The oh, you think so? Oh, yeah, the pass <laughs> interference to Hogan, bullshit call. And uh, what was the other – and there was another one on offense. I think the refs have let you in this game. But you, you think about it, it seems like the Patriots have had more penalties than the Steelers. So, I mean, that's kind of – you know, there's been a couple back – think about the, the pass interference they called on um, – I think they called it on Jonathan Jones, which wasn't a pass in the first. I mean, you can go both ways with that with that type of um, analysis. Yeah. The, third and, the third and long to Hogan was a horrible call. And then there was another one on, on your offensive series that was just bullshit. So you're right where you should be. You can't move the ball on offense. You should be down. Well, you're right where you should be. Well, I think when you look at this game, you look at it from the defensive standpoint. You know, they they the Pittsburgh Steelers have controlled the talk. Kevin and I talked about this how this running back has looked like. You know, the it seems like when it went from Le'Veon Bell to Connor to now Samuels, it's like you know the next coming of Franco Harris. The kid's averaging eight yards a carry. Well, this is why I say with all the love and respect in my heart to Kevin Fox, but the running backs are sort of interchangeable. I'm sorry, they are Kevin. They are. <laughs> now, Kevin, if you don't know, uh, Felger's biggest thing is is that you could just throw anybody back there at running back and they'll be able to get the job done. <laughs> kind of. Nah, I don't think it's like that, Felger. Kind of, sort of. 